Hello everybody. In this video I will show you how to create a new mode in your ABBA program, how to call a transaction in this new mode and how to close your mode in your program. For this I created this little program. I want to divide this program into three parts. Part one is the section open mode. And in this part, I show you how to open your mode, how to create your object. Second is the call transaction part. In this part, I show you how to call your transaction. And third, how to close this mode in this program. So first we start with the try block. Try. And then I declare my object data o underscore mode type ref to my class ef underscore imc underscore child underscore mode and then I call the method from this class cl underscore imc underscore mode and then create mode then we have an exporting parameter called mode type and this is cl underscore imc underscore mode and mode type main mode then we have an importing parameter importing mode equals our object o underscore mode Okay, now we have an object and the next is to call the transaction. So we write O underscore mode and we call here the transaction code. In our example is this the transaction code SE11 for the ABAP dictionary. And then dot OK. And this is our transaction call. The next step is to create a pop up. And with this pop up, I want to ask the question if we want to close the new mode. So we declare a variable, the answer. of type string and then we call the function pop up to confirm you we click on the pattern button we write here pop up to confirm okay then we have some exporting and importing parameters and tables and exception. In this example, we need only the exporting parameter title bar, text question, and we want to deactivate the cancel button. And so we need this exporting parameter as well. And the uh, importing parameter answer. We delete the exception block. Okay, so we write here our variable ans for answer. Then 
we create a title bar. We write here question. Then the text question is uh, close mode question mark. And we want, and here is the display cancel button. Okay. The next step is we want to check our our variable answer, which button is pressed. So we write case. Okay, first we okay we forgot the dot case answer when one one is for the button yes. We close our mode. O underscore mode close and end case. Then we need the catch block catch C X underscore root into data E underscore TXT. And then we close the try block and try. Pretty print. And let's check the code. Okay. Uh, C is root. Okay, there's a little typo. We need CX root. Okay, check again and activate. Okay, the code is okay. And let's run this report. Okay, this was a little fast. We have seen the new mode here and the pop-up. This is our upper dictionary and this is our pop-up. But uh, we see we have the cancel button. I don't want to show this cancel button for this pop-up. Then we press yes. Okay, the new mode is closed. And now we, uh, I make the window a little smaller so we can see the, the new mode better. First we uh, set the cancel button inactive with upper force. And next is I want to I want to have a, a little delay so we can better see the different steps. So we I write here wait up to three seconds, and after this the pop-up win window will display. Okay, let's run the report again. We see our new mode, the pop-up dictionary, and after three seconds our pop-up. The cancel button is now inactive. We have only the buttons yes or no. And if we press yes, the mode will be closed. Okay. Then I show you the no button. I call the program again. And we see the pop-up window again and I press no. And then the mode is still here, the new mode with the ABAP dictionary. Okay, and uh, next I show you uh, a dump because if we close the mode uh, before we press the button, then we miss uh, the reference. We have no mess reference. So I close this window and now I click the button, but there is no reference and we get a dump. So we have to check if the object is assigned and when is uh, and when the object is assigned we can close it. If we don't do this, we have this error. Yes. That was it already. I hope you like this video. If this so, I would be happy if you subscribe my channel. And I hope we see us again in some of my next videos. Thank you and goodbye.